Hey YouTube, what's up? It's me, my, me, Steven, and my brother Uriah, and we're going shad fishing at Bonneville Dam today. It's gonna be awesome. And when we get there, we'll show you what we're using and how many fish we catch. See you when we get there. This is the Columbia. It's pretty cool. That's an amazing view. Yeah, it is. We're passing Beacon Rock up here. About 10 minutes from Bonneville. Dang, that's awesome. Well, we're here and it already smells like fish. I just have a swivel up here. I'm gonna quarter ounce weight and it's probably about a two and a half, three foot liter down to that. And then I'll cast in, count to about 10. And then just reel it in and shad. So Stephen, any advice on uh, fishing these rivers? Uh, just let it sit for about 10 seconds before you reel in and then reel in at a slow to medium pace with a shot dart. Got a good one? Yeah. Alright dude, let's see what it is. Oh! That's what happens when you get antsy and you try to reel in the fish too fast. Rookie mistake. Hey guys. Be loud. So, um, me and my brother are gonna have a fishing competition right now. And it's whoever catches the first fish wins. Alrighty, ready to go. Like a pro, okay, he won that round. I'll win next one. Where'd you go, dude? You drop it? Yeah, I dropped it around. What the? Is it down there? It's called rock fishing. Dude, don't lose that sucker. Dang it, I should have changed. Alright, dude, put it in there. And I guess you a good size one. It's probably like a good pounder. 14, 14 inch here maybe. And this is the shad duck that I was using. Just a little red and white one. So yeah, I need to wash my hands. <laughs> hey Go. guys, it's um we're gonna have another competition. It's whoever catches the biggest fish in the next five minutes, okay? <laughs> oh five minutes. Biggest fish in the next five minutes. Go. So I caught the first fish of the competition, but my brother here dropped it in this hole way down in here. And I don't know, <laughs> we lost the fish. So I don't know if I got the biggest fish or not, but. Not on camera? That was the only one. Never happened, right? No, it's down there and I'm gonna grab it. What? Yeah, oh, oh. <laughs> You got it. All right, I think I got the biggest fish so far. Nice. 
Nice dude, on the pink jig head. Didn't even need a shad dart. Oh. Oh, Steven, dude. dude. <laughs> what kind of fish did he catch? Did he catch a rockfish? Shut up. Started raining pretty hard here, so we're gonna head out pretty soon. This guy never stops fishing though. Last one, ready to catch something. Yeah, haven't caught something in like. And nothing. Oh, got one. Oh. On the last cast. No way. It's a small one. I'll still keep Hi, how are you? Yeah? No! Oh. Steven? <laughs> wow, well, you lose it? Yeah, I lost it. This is how I'm gonna clean the shad today. You can fillet them also, but I don't have my fillet knife knife with me, so I'm just gonna scale them. So run your blade against the scales. Mm -hmm. There'll be the scales go to the tail, so you want to come up from the tail to scale these fish. See all these scales on those? That's bad. You don't want that. Just get rid of that in the river and. Just get the belly a lot too up here. So, um, come right here behind the pectoral fin, and um, so just start cutting. They're pretty soft fish. Just there's the head, get rid of that here. And just slice in from the butthole all the way up. Can you eat that? No. I'm not sure what that is. So do that. And then just get rid of all the guts and throw them in the water. And then just Wash the inside out of it, and then there will be this this um, bloodline right here. Right here, you just take your thumb, put your, it right there, and run it all the way out up until you get that all out. And do one more rinse. And if you really want it clean, just get all that out. And then you're left with this super nice, clean fish ready to go, either in the smoker or on the grill or something. Just repeat that. How many every time you have fish and then get back to you when it's all done. Hey guys, me and your edges just got back to the house from shad fishing and just wanted to say leave a like and a comment below, it would really help and see you in the next video, bye.